Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, hope you're all doing well. And tonight we're back with some more Genshin Impact. Traveling through Natland, so let's get into it. Not me. <laughs> Pause the music there. <laughs> Hello Kaching, welcome in, good to see you, hope you're doing alright. <laughs> uh, mail? I got mail. Oh, <laughs> it's Mona's birthday. Haha, <laughs> it's of course, of course, it's valid. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Very vest height. Let's uh, schluss. Life. What? Vest height. Let's uh, schluss. Schluss. <laughs> Definitely German. <laughs> cool. Thanks, Mona. Okay, <coughs> hang on. I'm gonna check up on my phone real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Open up my graham crackers while I'm here too. <laughs> I got graham crackers, cranberry grape juice, and coconut pecan frosting to dip it in. <laughs> my graham crackers, that is. I like graham crackers and frosting. So delicious. Make sandwiches out of it. <laughs> frosting sandwiches. Or I'll dip it in the juice, I'm not sure yet. Eh, broken now. Okay. She is a yum yum. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I like gun crackers. Especially s'mores. Okay, I'll see. Cool, let's go. Hmm? Ever wanted to join me? No. <laughs> Whoever you are. <laughs> oh wait, I almost forgot. <laughs> One second, guys. <laughs> I didn't post in the Discord yet. <coughs> I mean, I'm sure it's already there, but... If you are presently unoccupied, perhaps we could stop a while at extra. one code <laughs> Oh my god, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Oh, I'm lost. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <laughs> I go this way, I guess. <laughs> Loop around. I'm on my way. <laughs> Good team. <laughs> ah. No drowning. No frick. Gosh damn it. <laughs> ah. I witnessed a death. No, you didn't. No one saw anything. Shush. Shush. Back to your turnips. 
out to do some sea fishing later tonight we can eat whatever we catch fresh fish is absolutely delicious right off the grill i might actually go fishing tomorrow <laughs> actually hey moolani <clears throat> oh hi uh tony tony tonina oh mm -hmm. yeah what do you need the team sent out to find that the Night Warden Wars has returned. Yay! Gina? Is she back as well? Gina fell in battle. Oh shit! But don't worry. Not surprised. The team was victorious, so the team will be held in the stadium soon. Ouch. That's a relief. <laughs> this is cunning, and it was her first time. Mistakes are bound to happen. Pretty cool. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow's like a free fishing day or something. Exactly. <laughs> she deserves to hold her head up high. Alright, thanks for letting me know. <laughs> we'll head out again. <laughs> cool. <gasps> Jeez. You sounded a little anxious there. Had me thinking it was bad news for a moment. Mm -hmm. Honey, you said the abyss was cunning just now. But mm -hmm. it seems like the abyss just wants to destroy everything. Mm -hmm. Like, think of all those monsters that attacked your tribe. If there really was some sort of cunning plan, wouldn't it make more sense to send them to attack Kachina and her small team? Um, not that wants them to be in any more danger, it's just... <laughs> Relax, I get it. It sucks. The abyss is difficult to understand, that's for sure. Glance, it certainly seems like the only goal is total destruction. The abyss isn't a living entity after all, so what capacity for logic or planning could it possibly possess? But through our long history of fighting the abyss, we realized things aren't quite so simple. 500 years ago, the abyss invaded Tevat. You know about that, right? That's right. Conria suffered greatly during that time. But so did every other nation in Tevat. And Natlan was the worst affected of all. It took the combined efforts of the then Pyro Archon and heroes from every tribe to finally repel the Abyss. Even so, the effects of the invasion lingered for hundreds of years, only able to be reversed little by little. Our tribe's waters were contaminated. The children of Echo's territory was overrun by dangerous sludge surging from underground. Unrelenting black winds tore across the lands of the Flower Feather Clan. It was like each disaster was designed for a specific tribe. Sus. Exactly. We once thought that the Abyss's desire for destruction was a sort of primal instinct. But its methods are, in truth, marked by intelligence. We now believe the Abyss has invaded the Night Kingdom. And has the capacity to read the memories of this land at any given moment. And that's how it became so dangerous and cunning. Almost like it knows you inside and out. Yes. And that's why we've been unable to fully eradicate it. Even after all this time. Luckily, the problems left behind <laughs> by the Abyss have been successfully addressed by mm -hmm. the various Pyro Archons we've had over the years. <laughs> now every tribe is prospering and things cool. are looking up. I mean, just look at what we managed to do a few days ago. We totally fought them off. <laughs> you must have had to sacrifice a lot to get to this point. <laughs> every battle, every sacrifice is in pursuit of a future where we get to stop fighting. Responsibility, 
duty. Unavoidable burden. Everyone in that lane views the war differently. I believe we will be rid of the abyss one day. And the efforts of all who fought against them will become a story for the ages. To think that my name could survive in ballads passed down to future generations. It's kind of romantic. Everyone has something that drives them forward. You know? <laughs> Be my guest. Heroes are always welcome in that land. Anyway, let's head Cute. to the stadium. Our fishing trip can wait until Kachina's back with us. The sea's not going anywhere. <laughs> Foreshadowing? <laughs> oh, Alright. Well, next. Ah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Poor Kachina, I'm not surprised she fell though. She's a freaking kid after all. <laughs> Who sends a freaking kid to a battle? What the hell is wrong with this nation? <laughs> she should be playing with friends, not we're not going to a freaking war. Good lord. <laughs> Talk about child soldiers. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Cool! Mm. Pits me! <laughs> oh, this place is packed already! Yeah. Of mm. course! No one's gonna miss out on the chance to welcome our heroes back from battle! <laughs> it's their moment of glory! Wee! Wee! Yeah! She's never had many eyes on her before! She's cute! <clears throat> Yeah, she doesn't seem like the kind of person who likes being the center of attention. <laughs> just in time. Kinich, yay. Kinich, you here! <laughs> yeah, a commission ran longer than expected, but I made it. I heard about the incident with your tribe, Mualani. Is everyone alright? Yeah, it's all taken care of. Our new friend has got some tricks up her sleeve, okay? She's just as strong as Kachina made her out to be. Hey, look! Is it about to start? That's right. Someone will come out and be exciting you, Richie. And then we'll sing the old resurrection together. Come on, let's find his body to get view. When cool. the singing starts, just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Like her hat. Let's go somewhere mm -hmm. higher up so Kachina can spot us. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Poor Kachina. Warriors of Netland, heed the call of life. We are the inheritors of memory and legend. Those who grew alongside sun and wind. Those who forged our own destiny and future. That is Netland's fire, the lifeblood of our nation. It's too quiet. <laughs> huh. Why is there no music? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <coughs> mm. Why is there no music? Oh. Okay. <laughs> 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 That's my old banner, yeah, no, no. <laughs> okay, the music. Oh, now you need the music off again. Dang it. It's like again, like, burn bright. My bad. Hope I didn't mess up the music or something. <laughs> burn bright. Okay, cool. <laughs> So I'll turn the music in a minute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> might be bugged, I don't know. <laughs> I'll listen to it later. 
Smack you. Hey! You just haven't mm. gotten over the fact that Kachina beat you in the pilgrimage! Pathetic. <laughs> Both of you. <laughs> you did. But who can say whether that little girl <laughs> contributed at all? F you. Maybe she got scared and ran off. Why would the Wyab recognize someone like her, even if she was on the winning team? How dare you insult a hero of Natland like that? Kachina sacrificed herself to repel the abyss. She doesn't deserve to be subjected to your vile rumors when she's not even here to defend herself. Calm down, Mulalani. There's no point arguing with the likes of them. You can't just sit here and let them slander her like that. To insult a hero of Natlan, the person actually has to be a hero. You. You. Get her, Mulalani. Get him, sorry. It's really at fault. Never should have even gone to war. Well, true, because she's too young. But... Or the great Pyro Archon. Blah! The rules of our nation suddenly uh -oh. stop working. It's true. If she wasn't revived, it must mean she failed to achieve victory. <laughs> oh, Frank said. Maybe the wise Blah! interpret victory in different ways. I mean, that girl didn't look all that strong to me. Oh, f you. Ha! <laughs> She's been waiting for this moment for too long. No matter how daunting the situation, no matter how scared she might feel, she's always the first person to stand up and face it head on. You don't even know what happened. So don't you dare try to use this as an excuse to vent your anger or slander her reputation. Fine. We'll find out what happens soon enough. Then we'll see who truly deserves glory. May you be slain by the abyss. That's enough. No. There is no doubt about today's victory. <laughs> <laughs> or Kachina's part in it. <laughs> she is a hero Gosh. worthy of our admiration and celebration. However, the failure of today's ceremony is undeniable. Kachina has not been Plug. rekindled, Plug. and I Plug. offer you all my deepest apologies as I continue to investigate this matter. To prevent mm. further casualties, I have decided cool. to suspend the <laughs> pilgrimage until this matter <laughs> is resolved. Good, Good idea. No one is <laughs> going no one is infallible, <laughs> not even myself. Well, but good, doubt good. is a means by which we seek the truth. <laughs> not a weapon we wield against others. I, 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 cool. I, I didn't mean it that way. Uh, I just... Shut up. If there are things you wish to clarify, then ask me directly. <laughs> I answer if you wish. But now's your chance. You have concerns? State them. <laughs> no, uh, uh, of course not. <coughs> Dumbasses. Even though I have said nothing to change your mind, then it would seem the truth never mattered to you at all. <laughs> that can't even have the right to answer the Pyro Archon's question. <laughs> so much for all that glory talk earlier. Look at what happened to this stuff. I have a question, Archon. My friend Kachina. Do you have any idea where she is? It's extremely important to me. <laughs> My week about to cause some funny and violence. <laughs> you said you were investigating cool. the situation, but I'm sorry, that's not enough. I've already <laughs> shared everything I know. If you want to learn the truth and rescue your friends sooner, you should join the investigation. <laughs> Let's go! What do you say? Of, of course. course I'll join. In that case, Yay! come see me in the speaker's chamber. <laughs> oh, you get should join them. <laughs> if it's not too much trouble, <laughs> you drop by as well, traveler. Oh. I'd like to have a chat. <laughs> no, say, say less. Rest assured, yeah. everyone, I'll Let's keep the go. travel chiefs mm. informed on the progress of the investigation. Once again, I apologize <laughs> for the outcome of this ceremony. Mm. If there are no further questions, let's part for now. Um, mm. did she just ask us to come along? <laughs> I believe let's, she did. Finally, let's go. Let's go. 
I get to know what's going on myself. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> please stop at the cutscene so I can fix my sound settings, please. There you go. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <coughs> Hello, my week. The situation is urgent, so I'll get straight to the point. <laughs> Kachina is undoubtedly a hero of Natlan, and I'm deeply sorry this happened to her. There's been unrest in the Night Kingdom, but I don't know what's causing it. As a result, I've been unable to track down the location. Until we find and address the cause of the unrest, the Ode of Resurrection will continue to be ineffective. And that means Kachina won't be able to come back? Duh. That's correct. Not until the problem with the Night Kingdom is resolved. How long will that take? It's hard to say. Kachina always dreamed of fighting the Abyss. Of doing her part to defend Natlan. She wasn't afraid of death because she knew, if it came down to it, the Pyro oh. Archon would be there to bring her back to life whenever we sat down together. Oh, her eyes are Exhausted shaking. from training. Oh. She would always hum the Ode of Resurrection. Oh. She was supposed to come back to us. We were supposed to hug her and celebrate with her and share her joy. We supported her every step of the way, but what are we supposed to do now? Sit peacefully and wait for her return? Lose ourselves in grief over her death? Tell me, are we her friends or her murderers? That's not fair, Lulani. It's all right. I understand your rage and your grief. Kachina's life means a great Aww. deal to me, Mualani. Believe me, I want to bring her back as soon as possible. I would give you that peace of mind if I could. <laughs> oh, poor but God. please, hear what I have to say so I can at least give you a broader picture of the issue we are now facing. Considering the recent <laughs> attack on your tribe, I believe the Abyss has found a new means of undermining the rules of our nation. <laughs> what else is new? You mean... <laughs> The foundation of our <coughs> resistance against the abyss. Mm -mm. If we continue to hold the pilgrimage and send <coughs> teams to fight the abyss, there will likely be <coughs> more casualties. <coughs> but if we stop altogether, <coughs> the sacred flame will only grow weaker. <coughs> the abyss will scale up their attacks, <coughs> and the tragedy we saw with the people of the springs <coughs> will only be the first of many. <coughs> if we compare the two choices, <coughs> the former seems to be the lesser of two evils. <coughs> Sorry. That may sound harsh, but <laughs> bear the name Malipo. Turn fire. Weighing the costs is my duty. <laughs> the raw truth can be cruel. <laughs> cool. But we need to understand <laughs> it if we want to approach this rationally. But what would you say, Mualani? This is personal for you. Uh. And unlike Kanich, I dare say it's not a simple case <laughs> of weighing up which course of action is less painful, is it? I wish she's sweet and considerate. No. I can't choose between them, and I don't want to. Saying that one is preferable over the other is disrespectful to the people who suffered. Hmm. Aww. You're saying it doesn't matter whether I suspend the pilgrimage. <coughs> the consequences will be equally <laughs> painful. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what happened to Kachina breaks my heart. But I couldn't bring myself to sacrifice other people for her sake. And that <laughs> is the crux <laughs> of the problem. <laughs> it's not simply a matter of choosing the lesser of two evils. Either way, there will be people who suffer. <clears throat> and the end result will be the same. Belief <coughs> in the pilgrimage will waver. Once doubt has crept in, the yep. people will no longer unite in battle against the Abyss. <laughs> and yep. that is exactly what the Abyss wants. Mm -hmm. Their ultimate goal isn't to break the rules that make the Ode of Resurrection work. It's to destroy <laughs> the people's <laughs> faith in them. To prevent yeah. what happened to Kachina from happening to anyone else, we need to suspend the pilgrimage. So that is my current plan. And in the meantime, <laughs> I've made efforts sure. to strengthen each tribe's defenses. Then, <laughs> we have to find another way of strengthening the sacred flame to keep the abyss at bay. <coughs> this won't be easy. I'll need time to figure out the best approach. <coughs> I understand your anger, Mualani. <laughs> But I hope that provided some clarity, at least. Wow. Paima thought things were gonna get heated for a second, <laughs> but the Pyro Archon <laughs> took the time to explain everything so patiently. That's sweet. I owe you an apology, Archon. I let myself get carried away earlier, and I'm sorry. Aww. You're right. We need to focus on finding solutions. <laughs> we could always <laughs> hold a pilgrimage without sending a team to fight <laughs> the Night Warden Wars. 
That way, he would still be able to fuel the sacred flame. I've considered that, but <laughs> the two events have nearly always been linked. <laughs> this makes one a what? This makes one a look. Po oh, po. <laughs> Without the chance of <laughs> yeah, yeah. this, pilgrimage rankings lose Pope their wishes. prestige, and competitor numbers will drop. Cool. <laughs> Mobile. <laughs> With yeah. fewer participants, <laughs> the amount of contending fire produced will decrease. <laughs> And the vicious cycle will continue indefinitely. Mm. So essentially, the abyss has taken Kachina hostage. Oh dear. You've learned about the concept of ley lines during your travels, yes? <laughs> yeah. The Night Kingdom is something similar. <laughs> Staying there for a short period of time shouldn't have an effect <coughs> on the person. But with the abyss in the picture, it's a different story. Your sense of self will be devoured. Until eventually you become one with the sea. Imagine pouring a cup of water Sorry. into a rushing river. You can try to scoop up another cup, but there's no chance it will be the same water you had before. I won't sugarcoat it. That is the danger Kachina is currently facing. Just like you said, Archon. Both of these problems need to be addressed. Can't buy someone alive. <laughs> yeah, true. You can focus all your efforts on dealing with the Sacred Flame. I will go search for Kachina. The Abyss poses the same threat to you as it does to her. It is very possible you will not return. Knowing that, do you still choose to go? Uh huh. Kachina's waiting for us to rescue her. <coughs> That's all that matters. I failed to protect her during our campaign. Oh, okay. But I can make it up to her now. <laughs> I choose to go as well. <laughs> um, cool. Traveler? What do you think? Understood. <laughs> I'll support you in any way I can. The masters of the night cool. wind have a technique that can extract an ancient name from the ley lines. Hmm. If we can find Kachina's <laughs> ancient name, I can use cool. the link between them to pinpoint her position within the night kingdom. Cool. Then comes the hard part. Mm. You need to visit the night kingdom in person mm. and rescue her. Let's do it. But isn't the night kingdom a land of souls? Can we even go there? Under normal mm. circumstances, only <laughs> consciousness can enter. <laughs> but there is a way to go there in person. <laughs> However, cool. know that the Night Kingdom will attempt to repel you, and the Abyss certainly won't leave you be. That's fine by me. Same here. Fighting the Abyss is nothing new for me. So, uh, Paimon's the only one who's scared? Well, if you're going, Traveler, Paimon's going to. Seat Lolly of the Masters of the Nightwind once created an artifact that can be used to communicate with the Wyab. We call it the Spirit Speaker Stone. It was originally used as a ceremonial artifact wielded by the tribal chiefs. But that spiritual quality also means it can be used to search for an ancient name. That was the artifact I delivered to the Scions of the Canopy a few days ago. Didn't think I'd be hearing about it again so soon. Thank you so much for your help, everyone. Your thanks are unnecessary. I will offer you whatever aid I can, but your fellowship and courage are what will truly decide the success of this operation. <laughs> Besides, you're the ones helping me. I can only focus on one thing at a time, after all. <sighs> Traveler, I certainly didn't expect our first conversation to be so serious. Give us pyro powers, please. <laughs> I've heard yeah. all about your accomplishments. Ever since you arrived, I've been hoping to meet you and offer you oh. this highest level of hospitality. Aw, she's sweet. Um, why? Why? <laughs> what? Is that not what happened <laughs> in the other nations you visited? <laughs> it's really complicated. Yeah, things were pretty complicated at the start. And, you know, in the middle. <laughs> well, reputation's valid nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like it. Oh, After all, I've heard you are oh. someone who transcends fate. Perhaps even more than you can imagine. Mm. But we can talk about that some other time. <laughs> Interesting. Ideally, this is a perfect <laughs> for a drink and some musical ambiance. <laughs> but there are important things to be done. Mm -hmm. Oh, I almost forgot. Atea was wounded in the fight against Thank the Thank you, there we go. She wanted us to give this to you. Wonder. It embodies fond memories and my strength of will. That's what she asked us to tell you. 
Go. She said you know what that means. <laughs> Go. I Go. didn't think this day would come so soon. <clears throat> the flames of her life force. <laughs> I can feel them flowing within the talisman. <laughs> if things were different, the two of us could have enjoyed the hot springs together while she gave this to me in person. <laughs> we're supposed to be hot spring buddies after all. <laughs> oh, my heart. But don't worry. This talisman means a great deal to me. I'll take good care of it. And once this is all over, I'll pay Atea a visit. <laughs> Let's go! You said you didn't want to jeopardize the production of contending fire. <laughs> but that's not at all why you decided to suspend the pilgrimage, is it? <laughs> You're right. Even now, sure. the production of contending <laughs> fire is far <laughs> from sufficient. The gradual corrosion caused by the abyss has resulted in a massive shortage of pyro energy, and we're currently at the breaking point. Oh, is that why we couldn't get any pyro powers? This thing stands. <laughs> the pilgrimage lazy. is I'm a just lost cause. <laughs> Suspending it allows us to save our strength to defend the tribes. <laughs> the abyss has brought catastrophe to Natland. <laughs> I Chena's disappearance <laughs> yeah. in the Night Kingdom. It's a direct consequence of that. We can't let the general public know that. <laughs> no. If the public Kay. learned that Natland's destruction was close at hand, <laughs> there would be immense panic. Mm, that is terrifying. But if I said nothing at all, I would have continued to question the integrity of Natland's heroes. <laughs> Another simple choice. <laughs> the latter was clearly the better solution. <laughs> You chose otherwise. <laughs> I have never subscribed <laughs> to the belief that the right choice is the <laughs> one with the fewest sacrifices. <laughs> Let's go. There's still a way for the sacred flame to last a little longer. You mean? Yes. Come with me. <laughs> Meanwhile. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> the sacred flame must never cool. go out. Not only does it strike fear in the abyss, but it's also the pillar of Natland's stability. So until our heroes are ready, no. I will sacrifice my power to keep it burning. No. But that can only last so long. I think we should focus on the remaining ancient name bearers. Mm. Don't let desperation cloud your judgment. Those chosen by the Wyatt have already embarked mm -hmm. on their destined path. <laughs> it is for them to decide how that journey ends. Not us. All we can do is support them. Even so, for you to make this sacrifice, it's not right. <laughs> if not me, then who? No other is capable of sustaining the sacred flame. I possess great strength. I'm not above my people. This is part of my duty. Okay, she's probably the coolest Archon so far. <laughs> Oh, FFS. I can test her out now. Go! 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 The Archon of Natland. Oh, shoot. Not him. A force to be reckoned with. Oh, Capitano. The secret of the ley lines is no secret to me. Long have they been destined for ruin. Give me a weapon. And oh. Cecil both made five centuries oh. ago remains unfulfilled. <laughs> what use is the gnosis in your hands? F off. I don't know what you mean. But it sounds mm -hmm. like this is about more than the Tsaritsa. <laughs> in times too. of crisis, <laughs> someone must pick up the mantle of salvation. <laughs> your plan that. has reached an impasse. <laughs> and now it falls to me to create new rules for Natland. No. <laughs> Before the dawn of a new age, mm? the old must be destroyed. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. Ooh, I love his outfit. She's like, hey, I assume that's cool. the end of your speech. <laughs> People like us. <laughs> Let our plates do the talking. Go, on, we go. Boom, get him. Get him, get him. <laughs> Kick his ass. <laughs> Damn, she's back. 
and his followers must be apprehended. Let's go. That was amazing. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> they are both incredible. <laughs> uh, Metal says I have a thing for villains. Are you all right, Archon? Um, <laughs> I kind of hope a Capitan becomes a playable character someday. <laughs> that was a formidable opponent. <laughs> exactly what I would expect from the first of the Batui Harbingers. <laughs> She kept up pretty damn good. <laughs> I never imagined someone could match <clears throat> you in combat. <laughs> yes, by the way, it's been announced. Wait, what? <laughs> really? <laughs> When's he coming out? <laughs> Saritza sent him. <laughs> I'm excited now. Why would he bring up what happened five centuries ago? <laughs> I actually don't know anything about him. Yeah. <clears throat> and how much does he know about Natland? <clears throat> the harbinger is all driven by their own personal goals. I would totally the go for him. The only purpose <laughs> that unites them is collecting the Gnosis. Uh, apparently it's in one of my good Genshin buddies. Oh, sweet. I'll totally can do it then. See if it's, uh, see if it's actually coming out. <laughs> but I'm sure the That'd captain has his own reasons <laughs> for being here as well. <laughs> we should shift our focus Kay. to the Fatui. <laughs> if they attack again and we're not prepared, we're done for. I don't know when, though. Probably not for a while, I guess. No. Of this. We're running out of time. <laughs> The wound I inflicted should hold him back and weaken him for the time being. <laughs> Besides, so cool. I'm sure you noticed. The power that came to his rescue just now came from the masters of the night wind. In other words, there are traitors among us. Not necessarily. This could prove to be a very valuable turn of events. When we exchanged final blows, I sensed an unusual presence within him. I'll need to investigate further. Kanich. Go to the Masters of the Night Wind and look into who could have aided the captain. Speak to Seat Lali. She should know. Of course. I'll head out right now. Do you still intend to... Yes. But fear not. Uh, Kaching says hello. Uh -huh. <coughs> <Hi>. He said hi. <laughs> He's calling me a villain because I want the villain. Natland <laughs> <laughs> strength has never rested solely in its archon. <laughs> He's always said that about me because I I don't know why 
I just have a thing for villains. I don't know why their powers and, and their clothes are so cool. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Let me list off some of my favorite villains. Uh, my Otis Mon and Pied Mon from Digimon. Mercury Mon from Digimon. Uh, um, <laughs> Loki. <laughs> Uh, all the, all the villains <laughs> look happy town at this point. <laughs> uh, Green Pro was built, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I really hope he becomes a playable character. I, that would be great. <clears throat> What's he gonna dump the Gnosis in there or something? Mm? Cool. Mm, cool. We must trust in that vision now. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Cool. Hmm. Okay. Whoa. Is everything okay, Archon? Huh? Hmm? Ah, completely fine. Just lamenting the fact that I never got a picture when I could still turn my hair into flames. <laughs> ah, too late now. <laughs> I just <laughs> hope the others have a safe journey. <laughs> She's great. <clears throat> I need to go back and watch that fight again later. Music was great too. <laughs> she is, yeah, she's amazing. So sweet and selfless. <clears throat> oh, cool. Oh, that's what they <laughs> What's happening at this stadium? Did something explode? It feels like the Archon unleashed her power. <laughs> she must be fighting a formidable opponent. This is the definition of mean <laughs> Should we go back and check what's going on? <laughs> the Archon. She wouldn't lose in a one-on-one -on -one confrontation. It would be great to get to know, to get her. Yeah, I can't wait. Once we get Kachina's ancient mm -hmm. name, we'll head right back. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's just keep climbing. <coughs> Emma really hopes nothing goes wrong. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> yes, wind, please. <laughs> ah, if only Venti could do this. <laughs> Where am I going? Oh, over there. Okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> yeah, then on these trees, that'd be great. <laughs> Probably not, though. <clears throat> ah, Scions of the Canopy, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> you good? Wish you could. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Since he's the wind archon, after all. Animal. <laughs> Long climb. <laughs> there we go. Ha <laughs> 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 
<laughs> what is a scion anyway? <laughs> mm. 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 That's Wyna, the tribal chief. Let's head over to him. Sure, okay. Mm. Mm. <coughs> 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 Jessica. Oh, I don't. Again, why not? <laughs> I'm afraid we don't have time for pleasant okay. dreams. So we'll get right to it. Okay. We're here for the spirit speaker stone. Whoa, hold on a second. <laughs> At least tell me why you need it first. Cause Kachina, I'll give it. My friend Kachina is trapped mm -hmm. within the Night Kingdom. Mm -hmm. We need the stone to find her ancient name and rescue her. Rescue her? From the Night Kingdom? That's right. I'm sorry. But someone needs to tell you what you don't want to hear. Going there, a mature warrior would never make such a foolish decision. The nature of battle is unpredictable. You never know how it's going to end. Losing a friend is tragic, but when that happens, the best thing you can do is focus on how to prevent further casualties. I appreciate what you're trying to say, Chief Wyna. But if the price of maturity is abandoning a friend in need, I'll choose foolishness any day. If Kachina's still holding on, then so will I. I thought you might say that. <laughs> something wrong, Wyna? <laughs> this doesn't seem like you. Ooh. Life isn't complete without taking risks. That's always been your mantra. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing. The Night Kingdom Aww. is a dangerous mm -hmm. place. <laughs> Can't blame me for checking if you were up to the task. Mm -hmm. You're that determined. Far be it from me to stop you. Mm. Here's the stone. <laughs> it's safe, okay? <laughs> so big. It's not like we have a spare. Mm. Thank you. Huh. Seems like you two go way back. <laughs> but aren't you from the Flower Feather Clan, Chaska? Oh, Chaska's a peacekeeper. <laughs> so she's famous throughout the tribes. Mm. <laughs> she was the one people cool. call to resolve conflicts. Yeah. So we cool. slowly got to know each other that way. <laughs> her sister Queechee's always hanging sister around our tribe, Queechee? too. She's helped us out a lot Sorry. in the past. That's an interesting name. Oh, you have a younger sister? <clears throat> yes. I'll introduce you to her sometime. I love her hair. But let's get back to business. <sighs> Wayna, how do we use the stone? As you probably know, if your intended destination is completely different from the real world, the Night Kingdom is like a river flowing with concepts. And the ancient name you seek is like a tiny fish swimming downstream. In that sense, the stone is like a fishing boat drifting down the river. But the boat alone isn't enough. You need a fisherman experienced enough to steer it in the right direction. Man, people here sure love their analogies. We couldn't do that ourselves. With a little practice, I'm sure you could. You have the strength and the talent. If you want to make sure this works, though, I could recommend someone to you. Who? Vichama, a legendary warrior and scout from our tribe. He's got a keen eye and a well-honed intuition. Even his ancient name means to seek. If you're fishing for a name, you're going to want him on the boat. Vichama? Why does that name sound familiar? Yeah, it does. He's one of Auntie Atea's hot spring buddies. <laughs> I've heard stories about him. Where can we find him? Cool. Ever since Malco passed, he spends most of his time gazing out at the scenery from the cliff tops. <laughs> Follow the path that way, and I'm sure you'll find him. Oh, I'm sure she's a five star, yeah, Chaska. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. We'll go look would, for him there. Would not be surprised. Oh, thanks for touching the hydrate. Appreciate it. Good luck. <laughs> I hope everything goes well. Why does it always feel like there's something that nobody wants to tell us? <laughs> hmm. <Ugh. laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'll go on a little longer, then I'm going to call it. <laughs> yeah. Can't even talk because they were in the mood. <laughs> Lol. Pajama, where are you? <laughs> you are a bitch. <laughs> Just kidding. <coughs> Pajama. 
Gemma. I do Someone love her outfit. Someone admiring though. the scenery from the cliff tops. Ah, that must be him. <laughs> Hello there. Are you Vichana? <laughs> That's me. Did you need something? Push him off the edge. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> that was my invasive thoughts. Sorry. <laughs> what? You're saying you can bring someone back from the Night Kingdom. <laughs> How is that even possible? Mm -hmm. Think about it. Mm -hmm. Anything's possible in that kind of place. But that would mean... Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> Everything's fine. I'll help you, but I do have a small mm. request. After I help you find Kachina's ancient name, I want oh, to princess. use the stone to look for my friends as well. Oh, cute. Your friends? Sure. Oh, why not mention someone named Malco? <laughs> Is that who you're talking about? Yes. <laughs> I'd rather not get into it. It's all the same to you. Oh. That's not a problem. <laughs> we agree to your request. Yeah. Okay. Since you're helping us find Kachina's ancient name, <laughs> it's only sure. right that we return the favor. Yeah, yo. <laughs> Can I have a look at the stone? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> sure. Pretty. Green stones. Uh. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm. Huh. Look at his violence today. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Functions almost like an mm. abyssal pylon. Mm. Both connect the Night Kingdom to the living world. <laughs> Once the connection is established, the <laughs> abyss will come surging through the opening like a predator honing in on the scent of blood. <clears throat> so we have to be sure not to use it in a tribal settlement. Okay. Wow, <laughs> you got all that just from looking at it? <laughs> I just picked up on the basics, really. I still have no idea why it works. You okay. said someone named Sheet Lolly invented this. They must be a genius. I'll yeah. go find an open area and start setting things up. <laughs> In the meantime, I need you to get two things for me. Hmm? We'll go right away. What do you need? First, I'll need some hook ropes. Pretty much every store around here carries them, so no need to go anywhere special. Oh, and I need to build a net out of them, so make sure you get a good amount. Wait, are you saying you're going to use a real net to catch Kachina's ancient name? How does that work when one's tangible and one's not? By creating something tangible in our world, like a net, we can create a connection to a corresponding concept in the Night Kingdom. Basically, I'm going to use the concept of a net to catch something equally intangible, an ancient name. <laughs> okay, that sounds h hilarious, but also really cool. Oh, I see. And what about the second thing you needed? Right. I need there one... No, two chunks of obsidian. Once mm. we bring the ancient names into our world, we we'll need a place to store them. <laughs> Normally, you can only get obsidian from the children of Echoes. But I heard there's a traveling merchant from that tribe around here somewhere. So cool. Maybe you can try your luck there. Gotcha. Cool, we'll do that. All right, let's split up. <laughs> See that clearing? Let's meet over there when you're done. Okay. Oh, and cool. you can send someone with me if you want. Cool. In case you're worried, I might take the stone for myself. Cool. Well, what do you think, Chaska? <laughs> Fiatin. There's no need. Lena spoke highly of you. That means you're trustworthy. Good, <sighs> good. I appreciate it. Even though that doesn't well. mean much to me anymore. Mm. Anyway, it'll take some time to set everything up. Oh. So no need oh. to rush. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, bye. <laughs> <coughs> what an odd guy. He seems so defeated, but also really invented <laughs> the stone at the same time. <laughs> yeah. I've seen what I've seen what's this Minecraft. I'm never going to another again after hours of fighting and pain. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've never been to another myself. I don't have any more insight <laughs> than you, Paimon. <laughs> Let's just focus <laughs> on the preparations for now. True, true. Hang on, Kachina. <laughs> We're coming for you. Mm -hmm. Cute. <laughs> All right. Well, I think. Huh? What, what's going? What's going? Ding ding. Oh, <laughs> creature. Okay. I think that's probably gonna be it. Um, for me for tonight. It's getting late, and I'm tired. I need to get up a little bit earlier than normal tomorrow. So. <laughs> it's hell. Another. Oh. <laughs> 
lame. But, oh well. <clears throat> the secrets of the mechanical arts are super. Shush. <laughs> 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 Sounds interesting anyway. <laughs> oh, I got an achievement. Hang on one second. <laughs> Warmers of the world. Battle battlefield of ice and fire. <laughs> cool. <laughs> but yeah, that was really fun. So I have seven wishes. Three to go. For my next ten pull. Anyway, <laughs> <coughs> excuse me. Let's find somebody we can raid. There's a lot of people on today. <laughs> excuse me. Oh, <laughs> I haven't seen bootleg on for a while. I'll say bootcake for a while. <laughs> oh, he's playing. Um, <laughs> Well, it says he's playing Visage. But then it says he's doing the Mortuary Assistant new update. It has a new update? Oh, cool. But anyways, maybe he's playing Visage too. Anyway. <laughs> nice seeing you. Nice seeing you, again. Nice seeing you too, Kaching. Talk to you next time. Let me just read out here real fast. To boot keg. And there's the red message to copy and paste into his chat. If you guys so desire, anything emotes you might like to add? <laughs> anyway. But yeah. <clears throat> see you next time. Yeah, see you next time, Kaching. Thanks for having by. I really appreciate it. <laughs> and you know, very interesting story so far. The Archon seems super sweet and down to earth, and I love her to death already. <laughs> and yeah, hopefully we can save Kachina. Without too much of an issue, which I'm sure it's going to be a massive issue. <laughs> Hopefully that guy doesn't betray us or something random. <laughs> you never know. But anyway, <laughs> I'll wait and see. I'll probably do more of this tomorrow, so. <clears throat> you know me. <laughs> well, thanks. I appreciate it. Good to see you, Kaching. <laughs> but anyways, as always, my little nightshades, thank you guys again so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And until next time, love you guys. And I'll see you all again <laughs> very, very soon. Take care now. Bye-bye! <laughs>